Well, thanks to Leon for his first couple of races, and I want the colour now for the first two Irish Classics of the season. It's the Irish 1000 Guineas coming up first, and the first seven from last week's new market race are all reopposing, so this should be pretty interesting. Three, mile filly, three year old fillies, of course, over a mile at the top. Appenzell, fifth last week, Darren Thompson, Barante, Stellina, James Shea, Boss Beauty, Leon Van Rensburg, Elderbury, Symphony, Dan Hughes, Lioness of Brittany, Michael Scarner, Puritanical, Neil Mack, Pushin Burst last week's winner, Vinnie Gerard, Santa Barbara, Paul Rhodes, Saratoga, Slew, Paul Rhodes, Tumakaka for Craig Allen, last week's runner up, Zaman Kicks for David Robertson. So, all 11 installed then, and away we go, and. Is it going to be the same as last week? But right over on the far side, Saratoga Slew has got the rain and has got the lead. Down on this near side, Boss Beauty is also disputing the lead. Looking towards the back, Pushin Burst. Last week's 1,000 guineas winner is stone last at this point, but I think she probably was last week as well. Boss Beauty then has now settled down into the lead from Santa Barbara in second. The Grey Zaman Kicks has now come through into third. Then comes Linus of Brittany and Baron Testalina. Puritanicals after that one. Two Macarga is widest on the track with Appenzell next and then the back to Pushin Burst and Saratoga Slew but they're past the five pole and Boss Beauty is leading by the best part of two lengths to Santa Barbara in second then Lioness of Brittany and Elden Marie Symphony to Macarca Baron Testalina after that one the field pretty tightly group Pushin Burst looks like he's going to try and come around the outside the one that's making a forward move first around the outside is Appenzell also now Saratoga Slew's trying to get into it the grey Elden Marie Symphony bad burst through at the three furlong pole and so too does to Macarca and it's Elderberry Symphony who's taking it up from Boss Beauty to Macarca. Appenzell Zaman Kicks is trying to get going as well on the other grace. Saratoga slew wide on the track. Pushin Burst is still stone last with two furlongs to go. It's Elderberry Symphony the grey who's in the lead by two lengths to Boss Beauty who's trying to fight back. Saratoga slew Appenzell then to Macarca all trying to get into it. Zaman Kicks is trying to get out. Pushin Burst is coming the late run but Saratoga slew has taken it up. It's Saratoga slew from Zaman Kicks and to Macarca. Baron Tisselina it's Saratoga slew in the lead Saratoga Slew and racing towards the line Saratoga Slew takes the orange 1000 guineas it stays at home with the professor and tables turned from last week Pushin burst never got into it at all really uh, it's finished well down the pack so last week's guineas winners have been put in their place this week on either side of the Atlantic haven't they because Saratoga Slew has taken that one pretty comfortably and it's a one two for the professor the king of the classic saratoga slew takes it for paul road santa barbara for the same trainer second to macarca for craig allen third again zaman kicks for david robertson was fourth this week and baron testalina or james shea moved up and placed her fifth but pushin burst the 1000 guineas winner from last week only sixth really was kept too far back and was left with far too much to do so the Irish 1000 guineas stays in Ireland with the Professor.